hi guys welcome back to my channel this is Alicia and today we're gonna to be talking about my debt um, since this is my very first debt video on my channel I want to go ahead and get you guys a caught up and update you guys on what my debt has been and where we're currently at now so let's go ahead and get started this is my budget planner I kind of made it my own using um, the big happy planner this is from the wrong wrong collection um, with happy planner so let's go ahead and get started so I'm gonna go ahead and go to my spending tab so this is my spending tab section um, each of my bills including my debt or have their own personal tab that I've made for it so let's go ahead and get into it so my first debt big debt is going to be my mortgage um, we bought our house me and my fiance bought our house at I believe it was a either it was a at a hundred and thirty two thousand dollars we currently owe $123,282.67. We've paid off um, $8,717.33. So let me go ahead and show you how I keep track of that. So I'm just going to go to my mortgage tab. This is how I keep track of my mortgage. Um, instead of doing it by the amount, I did it by the years. We have had our house for four years, but after our first year, we did right refinance it for a lower interest rate. So we've currently paid off, after the refinancing of the mortgage, we currently have paid off three years. Every year um, in May, we've reached another year. So I won't be able to fill this back out until May of 2021. So I'm not really worried about that. That is what it is. Uh, so let's go into the next debt. My next debt is going to be my car loan. When I bought my car, I almost spent about, it was about 22000 I spent on my car. When it was at $12,900, um, I refinanced it for a lower interest rate. And since then, I've been able to pay off $8,000. And eleven dollars and ninety nine cents and with that I have a balance left of four thousand six hundred and eighty eight dollars and one cent so how we do this tracker and these tra um, trackers I got from debtfreecharts.com they're free printables that you can download and print off yourself so so far um, basically what I did as I broke this into there's 100 squares and I broke it into, um, divided this number by 100. So each square is worth $129. So um, let's see where I can fill in some more squares. After I did my calculations, I think I'm able to color in two more boxes. So I'm going to go ahead and get that color I need. So we should have 64 boxes colored in after dividing the amount that I owe so that I've paid off I mean so let's see we have 25 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 57 58 59 60 61 62 so I'm able to color in two more boxes in and it's so exciting getting closer and closer to getting to pay these off okay so let's go ahead and get into our personal loans for my pers first personal loan that I'd like to go check in on it's gonna be my discover loan so 
My Discover loan, I started off with 11000 owing 11000 I have paid off, or my current balance for this loan is, let's see. I now owe $3,978.41. And so in total, I've paid off $7,021.59. And when I divide that by 110, I should be able to color in 63 boxes. So I have so far 25 plus 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, and I get to color in one more. And my next personal loan is going to be my upstart loan. So on my upstart loan, I started off with a balance of $10,000. And I currently owe $6,591.30. And I have paid off $3,408.70. And divide that by $100. I should have 34 boxes colored in. So this is 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. So I'm able to color in one more box. And my last personal loan, which is the lowest that I have, is for my lending club loan. And I owe, I, I took out, when I took out this loan, it was $4,400. And I currently owe $2,696.49. And I have paid off a balance of $1,703 and 51 cents and when I divide that by 44 I have I should have 39 boxes colored in so right now I have 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 so I can color in three more boxes So now we're on to our credit cards. So the first credit card that I'm going to update is going to be my American Airlines credit card. I just made this chart and before I started deciding to make a video about this, I had already colored it in. So let me give you the update on this credit card. Um, I won't be able to color anything in because I already did it off camera, but let me go ahead and let you know how much I've already paid off. So the beginning balance was $3,906.99, and I now owe $3,535.36. And if you do, uh, which I paid off $371.63, and if you divide that by 3907, I should have 10 boxes that I am uh, have co should have colored in. And I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then the next credit card that I have is going to be my Navy Federal. I have a balance 
of, I just got this credit card. I did a balance transfer from my Capital One credit card to this one. And I have um, 18 months with 0% interest to pay this ba uh, this credit card balance off of $1,089.70. And I should have that one taken out, taken care of before 18 months is up. So this should be no issue to go ahead and get paid off. Now the last three ones are the ones that I was able to pay off in September so I no longer have a balance on these cards. My first one was gonna be my Walmart credit card. I started off with a balance of $5,319.09 and I made my last payment of $250 in September and I'm able to complete this chart and we're done. So let me go ahead and get that. Done. So that card is paid off. And then the next two payments that I was able, the credit cards that I were able to pay off is my PayPal credit card, which I believe I paid $75. It was my last payment on this. I had the beginning balance was 508.29 and um, I paid my last payment of $75, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. Oh, okay, this one was $45, my bad. The next one was 75. So let me go ahead and get that color green. And we have completed this chart too. It's so satisfying um, coloring these charts in. It just makes it more fun paying off debt. makes you want to pay it off so you can complete the chart. I'm going to keep these in my planner until all of my debt is paid off. And I'll be able to look back and see all the progress that I made throughout the years. This one is done. And then the last one is my Amazon credit card. This one had a balance of $539.43. And this one is the one that I paid my last payment of $75. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75. So we're able to complete this one too. it easier. <laughs>
So the last thing that we have to do is just update my debt priority log list. Let's go ahead and go to that. Let's go here. Right here. So like I said, before I started my YouTube channel, I had started off with 14 debts. I had paid these two debts off, which was my lumber liquidators for my flooring in a firm. Um, I'm not too sure, I can't remember what this was for, but we paid it off. For <clears throat> So these are currently paid off, which left us at 12 different debts. And now we're able to knock off the PayPal, the Amazon, and the Walmart. So let's go ahead and do that. I have these stickers from the Happy Planner. I'm just gonna go ahead and put paid on there. My Walmart, oops. my Walmart one is paid. And my goal was to have this whole page um, paid off by the end of 2020. So we're pretty close to getting that done or accomplished. So let's see if I can get this one, how, how low I can get this one down to. And I'm gonna go ahead and update my full debt overview. So my Amazon has a zero balance. My PayPal has a zero balance, and my Walmart has a zero balance. And we're going to be using my tool pen, medium point is my favorite. Just update this. Eventually, all these will say zero. And these were all credit card payments that I was able to pay off. So let's go ahead and get these colored in.
So now we're left with just nine debts, which is my mortgage, my two student loans, my upstart loan, car loan, my discover loan, lending club, and my two credit cards. So I'm pretty proud. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, comments, please leave them down below. Please like this video and subscribe. Until next time, bye guys.